Okay, okay, okay. So I'd like to welcome you back to the Distorted Cosmos podcast. I don't know who I'm going to use that as intro, but welcome back, welcome back. So today, if you was on my any of my, uh, well, I don't know if I posted it on the podcast page. You got to excuse me right now. My eyes are a little low. It's a little late and I'm a little medicated. But anyway, I am seeking a investment or a investor for potential fi- po- for a potential uh, Airbnb real estate. I really got notes right now. So I'm trying to, you know, go for the script and everything. And I'm trying to be sure I look at the two cameras because the camera's right here, but the monitor is right here. So I'm going back and forth between the two. So let's check out some things. So what we're going to try to do is share screen right here and share. Okay, so what this is is Zillow, of course. I'm not sponsored by Zillow or nothing, but anyway. So how I come up with these numbers is, let's just say I wanted to get something at Arlington, right? Let's see, what's something, what's this, what's this right here? What's this? Let's see, what area is this? First off, you got to scout your area, okay? Like, the reason why I don't look in Arlington is because we got, let's just say we're looking for the Dallas Cowboys Stadium, okay? We know that's somewhere around this area here. So what's 250? Okay, so 215. So we're going to use that on our calculator right here, 215. Actually, we're going to go to the mortgage calculator. We're going to type in 215. 15,000. Okay. Uh, I ain't got no 6,000 to put down. Right. You know. Okay. Let's see. 10%. 10%. Well, actually, you might have to do 20 because this is an investment property. So we might got to do 20% down on the. Um, 250. So your loan amount will be this, interest rate will be this. You look at that monthly payment between 15 or something, right? So we got to keep this number in mind. So let me write this down. I don't want to get sidetracked. <clears throat> so 15.38.43 is the monthly total. Now, after expenses, water bill, light bill, uh, cable bill, internet bill, some more shit. Let's just say you got a, about a thousand dollars in expenses. Okay, so we're gonna write down a thousand dollars. I know you can't see what I'm writing down now, but let's take notes. So we had fifteen thirty eight for the mortgage, <clears throat> and we had a thousand dollars for expenses. So whatever we do, we need to come out with a total of twenty five hundred thirty. Let's say twenty five forty. Okay, we're just gonna make it an even 25.40. Now you divide that 25.40 by 30. Over here, 25.40 by 30 equals 84.66. It was 84.66. So that's a nightly rate that we need to get to come up with our uh, 30 that thing, times 30. That's the good thing about your math, too, because you can always go back and just times 84.66 times 30. Boom. 25.9980. 25. 998. Okay, so $85. $85 a night for uh for this house right here. So this house is a 3-2. Right? Let's keep that in mind. It's a 3-2. All right. So what I'm gonna do, you can jump over to Air DNA to look at homes in the area and what they're going for, okay? So this is Arlington, uh, Fair Park area around here. I mean, Fair Park, yeah. that damn uh, stadium area is around here, right? So let's see, three, two, well, we're looking for a three, two, right? So this condo, it, sometimes this shit's a little hard to filter through. I 
I'm not that good at filtering through it. So you kind of got to, a lot of this is apartment, apartment, rental unit, rental unit, loft. Uh, can't see. Let me see if I can make my screen bigger. Boom. Look at this right here. All right, residential home. Three, two. Boom. Oh, shit. So a three, two residential home in this area is average going for this right here says two sixty nine a night, right? Four three two, and it holds ten heads. Ten heads matter. H e a d s h. Ten heads. Okay, let's find one or two more. Two more three two. Remember, we need some comparable to what we already got. Okay, three two. Three, two, it's a little far out of my zone. Uh, I just want to kind of get a general basics for the thing. Three, two, this one right here is 231. Let's see, 231 for three, two. And it sleeps 10 heads as well. Okay. Uh, what's this up here? Oh, neighborhoods three two three hundred, but it's a little closer. You gotta look at all these things around, all these things around it. Okay, apartment, apartment. Shit, it might get in a motherfucking apartment. Stadium walk, stadium walk two thirty four two two two. All right, so she. All right, well, look, we're just gonna go with these two, okay? So what I'm looking for is a 100%, uh, 100%, uh, we want to, we want a greater return on investment than what we're rating in, right? Obviously. So at this 3-2 rating at 22, 269, $269, I'm thinking big numbers, I'm thinking thousands. Uh, we're gonna times that by 30. And the other one is 231 times that by 30. Handy, handy dandy uh, calculator right here. Put my mental math 269 times 30 equals 8,070. And the other one, 231 times 30 equals $6,930. Okay. So you got to remember our expenses was uh, 2,500. So we got to take 25. We take 2,600 from each one of these, 2,600, which gives us uh, minus 2,600, which gives us 4,330 on the second one, and 8,070 minus 2,600 equals 5,470. All right, so let's just say, but this is at 100% occupancy, right? 100%. 100% occupancy. That's what you made. So we're going to, let's just say we rate it for 30% occupancy, okay? So 100% uh, so it. So 54,070. Uh oh. 1,070. Percentage 80. Boom. Eight percent. So let's just say we do. Eighteen days. Okay. Times thirty percent times times eight equals four. We will skip this shit point out. I don't remember. But let's just say we do 18 days, right? We only work this motherfucker for 18 days. 18 days at 26, 2,609 equals 4,800. Let's say it's 18 days. 18 days. At 18 days at that price, we're at, at that price, $4,842. 18 days at the other price of $31. So that's 231 times 18 days. That gives us a total price of 
eight dollars. Okay. Again, uh oh, lost my pen there. Again, take away our twenty six from our monthly expenses. Okay, so $4,158 to minus 26. That gives us $1,558. And the other one's $4,842 minus $2,600. That gives us $2,242. Now we're gonna split that with a 60-40 split, right? So you do that percent size times 40. So with a 60, uh oh, 40 split on the first one, I'll be making $896.80 off of this deal. And my investors will be making 200, uh, 242% times 60. $1,345.20. So again, you take that, that plus the 89, 896.8, that'll give us our $242 of the profit. So again, and on the other one, let's see, 15, 5, 5, 8, do the percent sign times 40. Okay, so the 60, 40 split over here. It'll be $623.20. And no. And uh, let's see, 1558% times 60 equals $934.84. So again, that's after the money is in the bank. That's what everybody takes home. Everybody's winning. And the exit strategy, the exit clause is if thing goes south, we can either rent it out with for a monthly rental, or we can, you know, sell it and still do the 40, 40, 60, 40 split. Everybody's a winner. See? So, uh, yeah. So, if you know anybody who got a little change and they want to invest in income, there's a lot more details to go into it. This is a high level, high level uh, kind of overview things. It's a lot more they got to go into it to kind of dig down and drill down for all that. So, you know, if you're interested to know more about it, let me know. We can get together and figure this shit out together. But if you know anybody who uh, is looking for investors, you know anybody who looking to to kind of get get into this thing to uh learn about it more again i'm educating myself and every day is a learning opportunity but don't miss an opportunity because you know somebody's learning right you never know imagine if you would have got on with steve jobs in the beginning when he was or if you got on with jeff bezos when he was in his garage I'm in my garage right now not really i'm in my office but you know what i'm talking about metaphorically I'm experiencing the experience. I'm trying, I'm doing something. A lot of people won't even try. A lot of people can't even get this far because they simply won't even try. They simply are scared to even try. God damn it, I'm putting a foot forward so I can never say I can't even try. So with that, I'm gonna let y'all go. I love you. Hit me up, email me. This video is sponsored by the Distorted Cosmos Podcast. Sponsored my goddamn self. That's it. I bought all this. I did all this. Thank you for listening. Thank you for being here. Like, comment, subscribe, share. And on that note, Again, I love you. Now I'm finally done. Bye.